To another video from Rogue Rat Hachi. Woo! Yeah! 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 Woo! Nobody cares. <laughs> um, anyways, uh, today's video will be about the new season of Total Drama Island characters. So, if you don't already know, there's a new season of Total Drama coming out. And everyone's making these videos, they're showing the trailers, and making their opinions on the characters. Well, here's my opinion on the characters. And you know what? Instead of just typing my response, I might as well say them out loud. Because that's better than just text typing and struggling on doing whatever. So, here's my opinion on all the characters and who I like the most and who I like the least. I don't really hate anyone, I just kind of just like... The characters the most in that movie. I like. I, I just can't wait for this new season, and I just like every character. I like every design, and I'm just interested to see what's next. And you'll see who I think is gonna win, also. And yeah, that. let's just get on with the first. Caleb. First, we have Caleb. Wait, I don't think he's been in a single trailer. Next up, we have Millie. Now, I see Millie as a good character. She reminds me of Lashana, and I think personally, I personally think so many people are gonna like her, and I personally think she might be even in the merch. She might even win the season. Now, me on the other hand, she has to be on my lowest of my list because I don't really mind her. And I don't wanna see her win, and I don't wanna see her, well, I don't wanna see her win. I, I just don't care about how far she gets. I know she's gonna be a fan favorite because I can see it, and her design, and she looks like she will be a good character. And I, I just don't see it. I, I don't know why I don't like those types of characters, but um, it's not because of the last. But um, it's, uh, she just has to be low on my list because I just don't really care for her as much as I do for everyone else. Next up, we have Emma. Emma too. Now, at first, I, I really think she's going to be an early boot. Um, because... Uh, she just kind of looks like she's the early boot, but I do not actually know. She might be a merger. She might actually make it to, like, before the merge begins. She seems like she's competitive. She seems like she can actually do something. And she seems like she might prove me wrong. But I also don't really care for her design. But I do like it. I don't, but I do. And I don't really mind, or no, and I can't really mind because the season hasn't come out yet. But I, I can, I try to feel her character. I see it, but I don't feel it. So she's gotta be low on my list because I, I also just really don't mind her character. Um, in her design, it's all right. Yeah. Now we meet the. Um, I don't know how to describe it. I don't know how to say it, but the character I thought would be uh, uh, the first to go, and. I, mean, I don't think she'll be the first to go. She seems like she's actually, you know, she can actually win the season. Or, or even or even just make it to the merge or make it far in the game. But at first, I saw her and I was like, she's probably going to be an early boot with Z. But um, now seeing the trailer, I don't really think that. She seems like she might get into an alliance or a friendship with Millie. Or maybe a... Mm, friendship with Chase as we saw in the scene but she seems like she is uh, a gonna be a good character and it's gonna show some character development and prove me all the way wrong because when I first saw her I said oh, she's gonna really good but now that I see her I see her in the trailer I, I think I'm wrong I think I'm wrong I don't think she'll be a first boot but I do think she's not gonna make it to the merge I personally think she's gonna make it to the merge but I might be wrong but I that's my opinion on Priya oh yeah her name is Priya and 
I do want to see a good character out of her. Because I do believe in her, but I don't see her making it far. As I said, I like all these characters. Next up, we have Bowie. 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 Yeah. Looks like he might be a really good character. And personally, he might even win this season. Now, first up, before we get into him making it far in this season or like getting it and even being the potential winner, they always say to be a gay couple, and he was, and in a promotional art, he was, he was really giving them goo eyes towards Caleb, and I thought maybe that'd be the gay couple, I mean, I mean, it was there, and it was kind of obvious, and they were said to be a gay couple, so I, that's what I assumed, I still assume he might be gay because of what we were getting shown, which is why I also want to say Chase, nope, Caleb will make it far. But like, nah, I don't know, I'm trying to second guess through the other rumors, but I think, I, at this point, I don't know. But, but before I make this long as it should be, shouldn't be, I do think he'll make it far. He'll be a merge character. His character seems, seems like it will be good. And the friendships that he'll make, I can see him being friends with Millie, Priya, and, uh, Emma. I don't know about Michelle or Julia. I, I, he'll be a good character, and I feel like he won't stir the drama. He might get in drama. I don't know who's not in drama and total drama, but I feel like he'll he'll have a smooth ride towards the end. And I mean, I just I just see uh, a, a, a some a, some type of rise in his character. I'm really looking forward to Bowie, and yeah. Um, next we have Ripper. I really don't know what this challenge is. There are plungers, like maybe cabbages, and there's something else here. Anyways, on to Ripper. Now, Ripper is said to be a early boot, like a first boot. I don't want to believe it, but I do believe he'll be an early boot. I don't really like that, but I do at the same time. I don't, but I do, because, because mm. you like, to be honest, when you see a new season, you don't want like these early characters to go so early because they all look interesting. Well, specifically this season, they all look interesting. Pocket Tail Island and Revenge, they had like characters like Stacy, Beardo, Beardo, Leonard, and like you didn't want to see him make it far. Like, who cares about Leonard? Huh. Anyways, but like Ripper, it seems like a good character. He might be. Owen in a way, he might rip his pants, he might fart, he might rip his shirt because he does that in one of the trailers. Why are you making so much noise? Anyways, but I really want to see some character development in Ripper if he does stay. I do think he won't make it to merge. I'll say that. But I do think he has, he, he can, like, overcome all these predictions of where he's said to be first. But I also don't want to believe that. I also do want to believe that he'll make it to merge. I see a good character right here. I think Robo will be good. And I don't, no, I don't, no, I do not think he'll be another own. You know he goes Moving on with Wayne. Wayne, Wayne, Wayne. Now, I, I never thought, there are character names I never thought would be total drama, and Wayne is definitely one of them. But anyways, he's a hockey player from Canada. Canada representation because uh, they're in Canada, by the way. And I love it. I don't know what it is about it, but I love this. Love his design. I love the character. I like his friend, Raj. They, they both look like they'll be a great duo together. They may be gay. I don't see it, but they might be. I think they're my, mostly best friends because they're both on a hockey team. Um, I'll speak about Raj later, but I will say this. I like his design. I think he'll have a nice character, and I think he will be a merger or sort of i really want to see him in the merge but i don't think he'll make it far yeah but i do see him in the merge if he does make it into the merge so for wayne i will say this i'm sort of rooting for you just a bit just a bit i'm, I'm rooting for you just a bit but now we move on to raj because i think i'll talk a bit more about him so now we have Raj himself. This is Raj. The other guy's Wayne. Yeah. 
They're best friends. They're hockey players in Canada, from Canada. And personally, well, let me start off with the their relation, not with their relationship. What I think their relationship might be, not the best friends wise, but nah, placement on the island. I mean, I think that Raj will be booted. Either no, no. Let me say this. I think Raj will either be an early boot or a double elimination between Wayne and Raj, because. This season is only to have 13 episodes, and there's 16 campers, so there has to be a double elimination somewhere, and then you have the finale. Is that how that goes? Yeah, whatever. So, I feel like Raj will either be an early boot, and Wayne will take a solo run, or they'll both be eliminated like, at the same time. But I also want to talk about Wayne here, because I feel like that they'll have some connection together, and they'll go through the challenges together. And they'll stick together, they'll stick on each other's sides, they'll vote for one person, they'll vote for... They'll just be a friendly group. They'll be like Katie and Sadie, but less annoying. And, you know, I, I'd love to see that. I mean, we haven't had um, many, like, friends in Total Drama, and I, like, outside of Total Drama. So I'm excited to see their character, and I really do wish them the best. Because, again, I just want to see all these character, good characters again. And I just want to see their how good they'll do in this season. So I like their designs and I like their characters so far. Did I talk about what I'm gonna be talking about? I'm gonna be talking about the designs, the characters from the trailers. Most of my mindset is on the trailers and what we've seen so far. I don't think I've said that in the beginning. Moving on to Mich Nichelle. Nichelle, not Michelle, Nichelle. Now she seems like she might be the villain of the season. Now I'm all for it. I am all for it. I have. Her relationship with Julia, like a friendship or frenemy or friends, quotation mark, I feel like that will steal the show. I feel like that'll be like the main focus and Nichelle will betray Julia and our girl Julia will go. Now, that's why I think she'll be a villain and I love to see it. Julia in one trailer said that she's famous and Nichelle is famous. Nichelle doesn't know who the hell Julia is. So, this might be a little interesting. They might, they might stick together, and Julia, um, once Michelle gets a chance, she'll just push her out. She doesn't need her anymore. Until, and then we get, like, the villainous, like, oh, come back, or villainous karma. And Michelle gets her karma in, like, the ending, or, like, the final three or something, whatever. Whichever, whatever. Um, but I'm, I love her design. I like, I like her character so far. She seems like she doesn't care. She seems like she's pretty pissed to even be here. And I feel like she'll be, uh, I feel like she'll be in the final three. I, I I had to say, I feel like she can be in the final three. Her or MK, and I'll get on to MK when we get there, but I have so much faith in the show. Whoops. And I don't think she'll be in early boot. That's all I gotta say, moving on. Now we have Damien, who reminds me of Lightning. Not cause they're black. But, I don't know, Damien looks like the, the like he'll be a potential winner, or he'll definitely make it to merch. He can't be an early boot. Please, do not kick this guy off so early. He has so much potential, potential. he's got the design, good character design, he's got, well, we hope he's got a good character, but, um, he really looks like he has potential to even, I don't know, be, be many people's favorites. And that's what I believe. I believe he'll be the favorite, and I believe he'll do it by, I don't know, being a nice, chill guy. He'll get along with everyone and do, like go through the challenges. You can even hear his voice. I think, well, I don't know what his voice has to do with it, but I, I think he'll be either, maybe he'll even be a leader. I think, I just think we have a good character right sitting right here, and I think he'll e e easily make it to merge. Easily. And if he wins, I would not be mad. I would not be mad if he wins, but he just cannot go early. Him and another character, I, I'll talk about later, cannot leave early. And I'm paying, I, I'm not paying, I'm betting, I'm betting on it. They, they just can't. But that's my opinion on Damien. Now we have Scary Girl. And personally, I thought she would be my all-time favorite, but she's still one of my favorites. Well, I like her a lot. And... People say she gives off this Harley Quinn look. I see it, of course. It's, you can see it. Duh. And she's got this, like, 
giddy, excited, scary character, and I feel like, I feel like she'll do good. In like a funny type of way. I feel like she might be Merge. She might make it to the Merge. I, I think she might be an early boot. I, like these characters are like, I want to see so much in all these characters. And I really want to see a lot of them succeed. And I want to see the character development, but man, I, I don't know about Scary Girl. I feel like she'll be an early boot, but I don't think she will because I think they want her to be on the show longer. But the time she's here, she better like, she better show out. And that's what I think she's going to do. She's going to show out. And she'll be funny. She'll be, well, yeah, she'll be funny. She'll be crazy. She'll want to do anything. Hell, she's even like throwing a bear, like from her bare hands, like, Blaming them from side to side. She's gonna be a great character. People are gonna love her. People are gonna be annoyed by her. She goes Yakama. I. That's all I gotta say. She's just. She's gonna be a great character. That's all I gotta say. She might even win the season. Now we have Julia, Julia, Julia. Now I. I don't know why. I don't know where this came from. But I have. I've never been this fond on a character so fast. Maybe, I don't remember. But like, watching these trailers, I thought Julia was gonna be, eh. I mean, they might, she might be a mean girl. That's what Nichelle and Julia are said to be. What leaked, m m sort of, not really leaked. They were said to be like mean girls, and I could see that, which is what I thought, because they kind of look like it. But like, I don't know where this came, uh, no, it was mainly from the trailer. She's like, uh, it was ironic that they put the two famous people on the same show, on the same team, and it's like, She's got this funny, not funny, she's got this nice personality. She's got this, like, she's got this influencer type person that I'm kind of liking it. And then I just grew on me. I like Julia. She, she, I think she'll be the, now, as I was saying to Nichelle, for Nichelle, I feel like her and Nichelle might be a duo. And then Nichelle betrays Julia. I do think Julia might make it to the merge. And I, and I do think Nichelle will betray Julia, making Julia like crush. She's like, what? But wh why are you doing this, Nichelle? And it'll be like, no, Nichelle, why'd you do it? And, and Julia will have this, this sad expression. She'll make everyone in quotation marks sad. Cause like, it, it depends on if you care or not. But like, I feel like we have something here with Julia and she'll be an amazing character it's just we gotta see it now so let, let's see what she does because I also think she's an influencer in a way that's what she looks like because she's always holding her phone well no I can't really say always but yeah that's my opinion on truth everyone a moment of silence for our next Asian character MK has to kill it this is I don't oh, oh yeah there is a lot of representation here like there are more African American like co color people there are like barely any white people which is crazy cuz you know total drama they were always just like I don't want to say like oh this was on purpose but like they were usually always making white characters and then they kind of added more black and then and Asians and then they're adding more like I, I'm not really trying to get into this because I can't really say much about it. But this is our next Asian character representation, and I'm excited for it. She's got to make it far. She's got to make it to merge. I love MK by her design, by her look, because she's Asian, because she's cute, because she, she already looks like she'll be a funny character. She might even be the villain, and I, well, I, I don't care what MK does. I want to see her succeed in the merge and i want to see uh, hell if she wins the season come on all right another asian character imagine heather heather kitty emma and mk all won a season asian representation rise anyways i think mk will be an amazing character and she, i think i just personally think that she'll be um, she'll, she'll show why you shouldn't, like, you know, not care for her. I think, I think we have our next big thing right here. I don't know why I'm saying big thing. Well, there are two seasons. 
but I, I personally I just I just think she is it. I don't know what it is, but she is it. Now we oh now we have uh, oh yeah <laughs> now we have who I think will win total drama island Axel oh she looks like Eva no way she gives off this badass vibes see her in the art she's got she's got like spray paint on her face she's yelling she she gives us this cool look she's got the good ass design this is our character total drama. I said there were two characters that better not go home early, and she is one of them. Damien and Axel, they cannot go home early. They cannot go home early. Now, I personally think she can, will win the season, because I think she will be given this sort of sergeant or like military type, forceful, badass character that she will not be hated whatsoever. I don't know if she'll get along with everybody, but she will have this character that will just be making me root for her because I do want her to win. But off of design, I thought she was gonna win. And I I'll tell you my final two after, after all this, but I think she will be the winner because she's just got the look. She's got the look and it looks like she's got the, the feelings for it too. Just look at Axel and you just look at her and you cannot tell me. If she gets eliminated early, I don't know what I'll do. I don't know what I'll do. I'll be disappointed. She cannot go home early. She's got to at least make it to merge. Final three. Final three. I, she's got to at least make it to the final three. Please. Please, Fresh. Final three. Even though they already recorded it or made all the episodes. She's got to at least make it to merge. And plus, she's my... She's my winner, or I guess if I made if I made the season, she would be my winner. But I think she's gonna win the season. And now we're moving on to Chase, the runner-up, in my opinion, who I think will be the two finalists, Chase and Axel. Now I like I love Chase. I loved his character design in, when we first saw the characters on the uh, setting out the the boat, not the boat of losers, the uh, the campsite fire with Chris and the chef, I was like, I love his character. I think he might be it. I've been saying it. I think he might be the character because you might look at him and you think early boot. You might think, oh, he's not gonna make it to the merge, but I, I think differently. I think Chase will make it to the merge and even be the final two. I think he'll show why he's not supposed to be taken lightly. He looks like he's like a, oh man, like, I don't know if I can make it this far, and I don't know if I have left, I don't know how long I have left to live. I, they're definitely gonna root me out, vote me out next, they're gonna do this, they're gonna do that, but I think Chase will barely make it through. He'll make it through and he won't even notice. He won't even know it. He'll be like, what, well, I'm in the final two? And, and I'll be like, yes, Chase, you are in the final two. Now, do I think he'll win? No, not at all. The Axel's definitely gotta win. I just see it actually. But I just feel like we gotta g give Chase this character development. And I think he'll even have a friendship with the, who's my favorite character in this new season. He's gotta have a friendship with who I'll say after. Yeah, I'll talk about it more there. But Chase, he's my second favorite character. And just, here's my final favorite character. Z. Z, Z. Z. Now, I love Z. I like his design. His character looks cool. In a promotional art, he's got like a, a drink. And then he's like with Chase. And then first time I saw that, I was like, I have my new Owen and Noah friendship. They have to be like this. Like they gotta be, I, I say like this, you can see me. They have to be friends. I hope they are like the best friends. And I really do hope Z doesn't go out so early because I really want to see this friendship go. And they better be friends like at the first start of the season. Cause like my predictions for who's going was like Z's early, go, is an early boot. Yes, my favorite character is an early boot. I don't want to see it, but I believe it. But he'll, be, he'll have enough time to make this friendship with Chase. And then that's what pushes, also pushes Chase to win. To try and win, of course. I, and unfortunately, as I do see Z going home early, I still think he's gonna be a funny character. I still think he's gonna make the his time. Or, 
uh, do whatever he want, do whatever he needs to do when while he's here. And he'll, I don't know what he'll do, like interaction wise, but I feel like Z will be an amazing character for the time being because I feel like he'll be booted out. I don't know, well, whatever reason, because usually they come up with sort of reasons. But that's what I, that's what I'm hoping, or not to whom I'm hoping. That, but that's my favorite character uh, in this new season, and I'm just so excited. So that was every single character in the new Total Drama season. After I will be making this again after. Total Drama is over, or the, the first season is over, because there's two new seasons, and I'm pretty sure they're supposed to have the same cast. Kind of wish it was a old source too. I'm not gonna lie, but like, I don't think they they were doing that. Um, I'm pretty sure it's confirmed that they're not doing that. They're two new seasons with the same cast, which also gives more character development for who's ever booted out early, which I'm excited for. But yeah, that's about it. Um, I haven't made it. I made this tier list. Um. Or who I think, or who I like the most, and I, I think I should also add who I think will my my placement for who's like winning or my my ranking because I I didn't really talk about that. I'll add that at the end of the video, and so you can see my thoughts on it. But I'm excited to watch the season. I'm excited to binge watch it, and I'm excited to see who wins. And I'm going to eat so much my my words because watch Axel not win. Priya make it far and Millie win. I, but I'm hoping good for all these characters because I like their designs. There's no character I really hate. I just like, like as you can see, like as you can see um, on my tier list, I have like don't hate, but like just not like as much as I do everyone else. But yeah, um, once Caleb, I'll tell you my opinions on Caleb after the season ends because they're gonna obviously gonna show Caleb. And you know, if Caleb is an early boot, I think he he goes due to the fact that he I don't know got cocky or something. So that's all I gotta say, honestly. And I hope you enjoy the rest. I can see the zits right on his face. Really? We were that close. Almost. Gets you nowhere around here. You're a loser duo, that's all. Loser is what the- Congratulations, you made it to the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed the video. Check out more on the left to right. Check out my channel. And if you want, like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, you can walk home now. I can't wait to see what we upload next. I think we're on to something, you know?